Our power transformer came last night so we took the shutdown of our substation to pass the transformer through a 33 kV conductor light. Welcome to this detailed explanation of how we successfully unloaded a 125 MVA power transformer. Let's dive into the step-by-step -step process, highlight the tools we used, and even share a few relatable examples to make this technical process easier to understand. The star of today's show is a 125 MVA, 33-220th of a kilovolt transformer, manufactured by Crompton Greaves Limited CGL. This transformer embarked on a long journey from Bhopal to Gujarat, traveling on a specialized multi-axle trailer. Think of it like moving a giant, super delicate fridge only this one weighs several hundred tons. The trailer used for this journey wasn't your ordinary one, it was a multi-axle trailer equipped with hydraulic suspension. Imagine a bridge that can flex and adjust itself to keep its load stable over rough terrain. That's what this trailer does. This design ensures that the transformer's weight is evenly distributed, preventing damage during transit. Before the actual unloading, the transformer needs to be perfectly aligned with its foundation. Picture trying to fit a key into a lock, if it's even slightly off, it won't fit. Our team uses guiding tools and precise measurements to get the alignment spot on. This step is crucial to make the rest of the unloading process seamless. Now comes the real action, unloading the transformer. For this, we employ a combination of hydraulic jacks and a chain pulley mechanism. These tools work like the arms and fingers of a giant robot, lifting and placing the transformer gently. Hydraulic jacks are placed under the transformer to lift it slightly off the trailer. These jacks are incredibly powerful, capable of handling heavy loads while providing controlled movement. If you've ever used a car jack to change a tire, think of this as its hulking big brother. Once the transformer is slightly lifted, the trailer is carefully moved out of the way. It's a bit like sliding a plate out from under a stack of pancakes without toppling them, only here, the stakes are much higher. With the trailer out, the chain pulley mechanism comes into play. This setup gives us precise control to lower the transformer onto its foundation. It's like using a fishing reel to slowly and carefully lower a prized catch into the water, you don't want any sudden jerks or mishaps. The process can be broken into these key steps. Securing the trailer. The trailer is anchored in place to ensure it doesn't shift unexpectedly during the unloading. Lifting the transformer, hydraulic jacks are used to lift the transformer off the trailer. This requires constant coordination and monitoring to maintain balance. Removing the trailer, once lifted, the trailer is gently moved away, leaving the transformer suspended. Lowering with chain pulley, the chain pulley mechanism is operated to lower the transformer steadily and safely onto its foundation. During every step, our team is on high alert, monitoring the equipment and load to ensure safety. Think of it as a carefully choreographed dance where even a single misstep could cause a serious issue. Finally, the transformer is securely placed on its foundation. Bolts are tightened, and additional support structures are added as needed. It's like the final step of setting up furniture tightening all the sprues to ensure nothing wobbles. This process highlights the importance of precision, teamwork, and the right tools. Just like building a house starts with a strong foundation, installing a transformer requires everything to be perfectly aligned and secure for long-term reliability. We hope this walkthrough has given you a better understanding of the unloading process. From its epic journey on a hydraulic trailer to its careful placement with hydraulic jacks and chain pulleys, this transformer's story is a testament to engineering excellence.